Hello guys, and welcome to the second to last LEGO Batman movie set analysis video. In this video, we will be analyzing the Scuttler, the second biggest set. 775 pieces. I'm expecting $70. I do believe it is $70, not $80. It still could be $80, but I do believe the price is $70. I'm not entirely sure, but that's what I believe it is. Don't quote me completely on that, but that is what I do think it is. So... You get many minifigs in the set. Six. So, of course, you get Batman himself. Then you get Barbara Gordon, a.k.a. Batgirl, but she's in kind of a police outfit. That version of her is exclusive. Then you get Dick Grayson, a.k.a. Robin, in his kind of a casual, formal suit, which is also an exclusive version of him. Then you get Commissioner Gordon, again, exclusive. You get the long-tailed Joker, which you could get in a much cheaper set, but it is very nice to get the main antagonist of the villain. Wait, what? The main villain of the movie slash antagonist. <laughs> that's what I was sort of trying to say, but then I put villain at the end of the sentence. <laughs> then you also get Poison Ivy, who is also exclusive. Probably the most exciting minifig in this set. Then there's a net that seems like it can be loaded into the scuttler. Probably here. To, of course, catch the Joker and Poison Ivy. Of course, you also get a piece disconnector, because it's a bigger set. This is the cockpit. For Batman, he also has a jetpack. Uh, I'm not sure if that connects to the scuttler or not. I do think the cockpit does come off. It does look like it. And there's a little bit of movement here in the legs. Uh, and back here, I can't really see. Oh, I'm actually, no, I can see that. So that means there is movement there. Not sure how much movement this thing will have. It does look pretty cool, the scuttler itself. I, I believe it is not a actual Batman vehicle. I do believe... It is something Lego made up completely for this movie, which is awesome because it's very cool. Oh, and I forgot to mention, stud shooters on the side you got right there. Uh, so that's pretty cool, and they shoot directly down, so it's like if one if uh, Poison Ivy or Joker was here, shoot them. And as I said before, this is probably where the net goes. Oh, this! I didn't notice this. Uh, this thing, it, it is pretty awkward, but I do think it's like a, a ripcord or something like that. You pull it out. And then something happens with this. It's probably one on the other side as well. Maybe come on the box. See that? Oh, no, we can't really. Right, it, because of these, I do believe that's what it's going to be. That you can pull that out like a ripcord. So that's pretty cool. But yeah, this set, it's, it's going to be very expensive, so I won't be getting it. Although it does have some very nice minifigs. I think minifig collectors are going to like this set a lot. Because uh, there's four exclusives in this set. But, thanks for watching, I'll see you next time, remember to like and subscribe so you do not miss the final set analysis video, and goodbye.